Hello, welcome to the third video in our video series, Creating Informative Outlines, Format 1. In this video, we will be discussing the elements of the conclusion. What are visual aids? Ending with, how to format your bibliography. According to the textbook, Communications, Principle for a Lifetime, it defines conclusion as, closing the lines of the speech, which leaves a final impression. The summary statement is a review of the main ideas. Remember to build redundancy. Tell them what you're going to tell them, tell them, and then tell them what you have told them. The clincher should connect to the attention getter. Hence, how it got its name, Bowtie Clincher. When the attention getter and the clincher connect, it creates a bow and wraps up the speech. Hmm, bows and wrapping. Well, a good speech is like a present for the ears. Be sure to use one of the following strong ending techniques. Appropriate quotes, examples, illustrations, or with humor. It should be written out under Roman numeral two. Now that we have gone over the elements of the conclusions, we will now be going over what a visual aid is. The visual aid is the presentational aid used during your speech. In the aforementioned textbook, it states, the term presentation aid refers to anything your audience can listen to or look at to help them understand your ideas, images, text, video, audio, objects, models, and people are some types of presentational aids. Be specific, express plans or ideas. For instance, do not write PowerPoint. Indicate what you are planning or your ideas about, what is included in the slideshow. After covering the visual aid, it is now time to format the bibliography. The bibliography is where you cite the work you use for your research. Your instructor will tell you what format to use, be it MLA, Modern Language Association Format, or APA, American Psychological Association Format. Always put them in order alphabetically and by author. If the author is unavailable, then by title or document. Indentions and punctuation should be done according to format. Today we went over how to do a conclusion, visual aids, and the bibliography. Don't forget your bow tie clincher. It wraps up your speech in a neat bow.